Yeah, I think the monarchy's in a lot of trouble because uh, you know, they've lost their star player. The big difference isn't so much Charles himself, but the fact that he's not the Queen, and the Queen was the monarchy for so many people. We all struggle to heat our homes, we have to pay for your parade. Thank you for coming. The taxpayer pays 100 million for you, what for? I just think it seems a bit silly when we're, you know, we've got so many people struggling to have something so extravagant right now. But some people argue tradition, I suppose. We do see, as, as has been historically, actually younger people less likely to be supportive of a monarchy. But also today, with higher numbers of ethnic minorities in our population, they're less likely to be favourable to a monarchy. Those located in London and Scotland, less likely to be favourable. And also, we see that the middle classes, uh, those in the middle income groups, they are more likely to be slightly more favourable towards a republic.